for fight two, and there's the bell. Oh, oh my gosh. She. Oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> Mate, Apollo's doing way better this time. G'day, Marshmallows, and welcome back to the Coco Couch. We are watching Rocky 2 today. I, I really, really loved Rocky. I'm so invested in this story now. I think because he lost in Rocky, um, it's making me want to see him actually win now. I just need him to win. He deserves it more than anybody else. I hope that... Um, it's a rematch between him and Apollo Creed. So yeah, without further ado, let's jump into it. <laughs> oh, here we go again. I love it. Oh, is this like a recap? I'm surprised they're showing us him getting knocked down again. <laughs> oh, that's right. I forgot he really injured him there. Stop this fight, I'll kill you. <laughs> I wonder how long it'd take for them to recover after a fight like this. Yeah, they look like they've been on a war, these two. Oh, look at that. Hard left and right. Yeah, his body shots are devastating. Mate. <laughs> <laughs> it's so awesome. <laughs> right, is that why they're showing us that? <laughs> there ain't gonna be no rematch. Ugh. What do you think about when the fifteen person you're coming out? Adrian! 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 That's great, we just saw the end of the last movie again. <laughs> it's just them taking him to the hospital. <laughs> I know Apollo Creed said there ain't gonna be no rematch, but I feel like he's got the ego that Rocky doesn't, where he's gonna be like, actually, I need to prove to the world that he I can beat him up easily. I feel like Rocky would probably just let it go. How about a statement, Rocky? I don't know, I am a lost for words. <laughs> Yeah, what a time to be answering questions. Is that the worst beating you ever took? No, you're gonna get worse if you don't get out of here. Hey, oh. What'd you think going into the last round? I don't know that I should have stayed in school or something. <laughs> That's great. What you did was a miracle. You're the luckiest man on the face of the earth. Do I look lucky? Look, no. S yeah. I'll fight him any place, any time. Yeah. Does that mean there'll be a rematch? Any place, any time, man. Can you hear? Hey, yo, Paul, you, you said there weren't gonna be no rematch. Any place, any time. Well, I'm officially retired now. Oh my goodness. I love how happy Adrian was about him not him retiring. I love you. I love you. I love you. That's adorable. Rocky's such a good guy. My nose, I'm a little depressed about my nose. <laughs> the eye that concerns me. Oh, the eye is great. Yeah. He was so proud of it not breaking. Okay, I got a little favor I'd like to ask you. Oh my gosh. Already? Don't they give me your old job with him. Yeah, I'm good with numbers. Yeah, tell him uh, to give you my old job with him. Paulie's a vampire. He's just making the most of his friendship with him. My kid would die for your autograph. Uh, uh, my good friend, Charlie Flynn. It's my first autograph. That was sweet. It's only just begun, though. His fame. Yo, Apollo. Oh. How was it? Did you answer me one question? Did you give me your best? Yeah. Thank you. Wow. That shows a lot of character just caring about whether your enemy really tried their hardest, right? Now he can feel the validation of like, I I went the distance with a guy who was really trying. It's great to be outside, you know? Adrian looks so cute. I kind of like this zoo a lot, you know? It's a special place, especially when it snows. You know, I was wondering, like, what do you think you're doing for like the next uh, 40 or 50 years? No. I was wondering if uh, you wouldn't mind marrying me very much. <laughs> What'd you say? If you wouldn't mind marrying me too much. Yes. Oh, that is the most adorable proposal. Oh, oh that's so sweet. I was hoping you wouldn't mind marrying me too much. <laughs> that's fantastic, isn't it? Oh! 
man, these movies make me so happy. Yeah, absolutely, yes. Volevi prendere a Rocky Balboa e presente per vostro marito? I do. Thanks. <laughs> She's so shy. Good luck. Thank you, you. Got to go back to the gym. I got a couple of good prospects. They're really good? Yeah, they're pretty good. Oh, that's sweet. I love that they're closer now. I bet he feels so good. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, at least it's good to see that she's having a great time. Sometimes it's hard because she's so shy. I can't believe we're married. Oh, we are. I got proof in my pocket. <laughs> What'd you have on? About 20 sweaters, was it? No. Uh, three. The best girl in Philly, you know? Uh, oh, yeah, I said that. Really? Oh, yeah. Aww, she's so sweet. He's so outgoing and encouraging. They could probably upgrade right now. It was the best thing ever come to my crazy life. You know that? <laughs> yeah. At the end of the day, Rocky just wants Adrian, right? I hope you... You never get tired of me. You ain't never get rid of me. I hope nothing changes. I ain't changing I shit. I ain't never changing nothing about you. Oh. <laughs> I love you. I love you too. Oh. Oh, it's surprising she still has, you know, that much self-doubt. And... Oh, goodness. Why am I crying this early into the movie? This is not a good sign. <laughs> It's a great guy. Hey, here's the paper. Congratulations. Lots of luck. Same right. to you. I'm gonna be doing commercials now. I can afford this. Uh, Rocky. Tell me that wouldn't look great on you, huh? This coat here? Oh, no. So I say we get it before someone else buys it. What do you say? I think that would be perfect for her. Yeah, I think that's perfect, too. Oh, this is what I was worried about. Him just splurging. Hi, kids. Look at that. Your neck looks great, huh? And that's what I call class, huh? Because oh, yeah. <laughs> Adrian's shy, she's probably not gonna tell him what's up, you know? Look at these bricks, Adrian. I like these bricks. They're very nicely done here. Look. <laughs> Almost add up to 90. I like that. That's a good omen. <laughs> he doesn't oh, stop, does wow. he? Hey, Adrian, that's a great spot for a radio right over there, you know? <laughs> it is cute, though, seeing how excited he is. What are taxes every year? 1500 $1, Yeah, I know a pretty good deal when I see one. I want to talk to my husband for one second? Yeah, I don't mind. I say we get the house now. But we need to go upstairs. I don't mind. It's just details. I'm sure it's nice. Oh, no. Well, it wouldn't mean nothing without you being here, because, I don't know, without you being here, I probably I wouldn't be here either, you know? Even through all this splurging money, he's still such a sweetheart. <laughs> this one came from London. You were a fake. The fight was a fake. Go kill yourself. Dude, don't look at the negativity. It's your disgrace to your people. Why can't you ignore it? Whoa. Are you serious? She's right though, but his ego is too inflated. Yes! Hey, what are you blind, Rob? Hey, what are you getting wise with me? He's such a community guy, I love it. Oh. Yes. Yo, Adrian, you did it! Um, what? Your good looks, you know, and your good brains, and my good left talk is really gonna be something. That's so good. It's gonna be a good somebody like you. Like you. No, 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 like you. Like you. No, no, like you. <laughs> we did it. That's adorable. How I look? The best. Fabulous. Adrian, how I look? Different. Sensational. Ooh. Yeah, surrounded by yes men. Well, how do I look? I look stupid, don't I? Yes. <laughs> she was so blunt. Action. Go well, now. Action! And it makes me smeal mainly. Smeal mainly? Can you read that right? Yeah. Well, let's go again. Do you think this stuff smells like a man? I'd say absolutely no. Yeah, this doesn't suit him at all. <laughs> Action! After shave will turn the women into beasts. Cut! This is so humiliating. Action! It smelled like a jungle rat. Cat, I rat. Cut! We're cutting this set. We're yeah. going to the alternate set. We've only wasted four hours. Four hours of that? Well, they just shouldn't have him doing commercials where he has to do lines. Step out, please. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Steve. My name is Rocky Balboa. They say I'm the American dream, but not because. Oh no. Uh, you know, I ain't punchy. I got just the way I talk here. What's the difference? Oh, you ass. Well, you're a rude guy. I'm trying very hard and you're being rude. You want to quit? 
Then quit! I didn't want you for this setup in the first place. You have wasted, wasted our times. You've wasted your own time, mate. You cost us thousands of dollars because you can't read. Snarled the robber. By oh. God, fellas, grab your right. Now he's gonna try to read. Do you have a criminal record? Nothing worth bragging about. <laughs> You'd be interested in some sort of manual labor? I'd like to see if I can make a living sitting down like you're doing over there. No one's going to offer you an office job. Why don't you fight? I've read somewhere you're a very good fighter. Uh, well. Well, thank you very much for your time. I appreciate it. But I thought he, he really enjoyed fighting. Like, I get that it hurts, right? But he's in a really good position to get some high-paying fights. Do I want to be doing something I ain't going to be happy doing? We need the money now, Buckus. Uh, dogs don't want to hear my problems. <laughs> it's a shame. He'd do so much better today with social media and stuff. He could make so much money. Okay, we got a load coming in. <laughs> yeah, no, nah, he's going to be so unhappy doing this. Yo, Rock! i got to let you go. What? Yeah, real good, but we gotta cut back on manpower and you ain't got enough time here. Mate, so even though he's working his butt off here, he's gonna lose his job just because he hasn't been there for long. Listen, uh, boy, you wanna buy this car, you know? I thought you liked it. I don't need it no more, you know? I have a hard time making these right uh, turns my bad eye keep it. Yeah, no, he's losing money, isn't he? Why don't you be smart and fight again? That's okay, I don't need to fight no more. Listen, you wanna buy the car? Yeah, my sister giving you a hard time? You know, she is, you break her teeth. But I kinda like her teeth, you know, where they are. <laughs> I don't think Adrian's got an ounce of negativity. Yeah, fight again, mate. You obviously love it. I got canned today. You know, it's nobody's fault. We're just cutting back, you know, his economics. What are you gonna do? Think about fighting. The doctor said you shouldn't fight anymore. He recommended I don't fight, and I recommend that I do. <laughs> oh, Rocky, you gave me your word you wouldn't fight anymore. If we need money, I could get a job. You don't have to do that, but I'm the one who's supposed to support. I I get it. I know times are different now, right? But you really want to do it? Yeah, we, we need the money. You know what's best. Then. Yeah. It's like regardless of what you think about what a husband and wife's role is, it's he, he believes the right thing to do is to provide. Who the hell is that? Oh my gosh, mate! <laughs> Avon lady, what's that, Rocky? <laughs> hey! What a prodigal summary to him. Oh, okay. Your fighting career is over, kid. Is that oh, right? Wow. Yeah, I think that's right. You shook the hell out of the champion of the whole wide world. You'd be happy with that. His career's only just started. I want to show you something now. Bring my finger in here. Tell me when you see it. Okay. There's a little thing I see. It. That's good. Oh, uh, the right. Now look here, will you? I uh, see it. Uh. Now you see nothing. Creed would have caved in the whole side of your face. She ain't got the tools no more. Now forget it. Well, maybe it's you who ain't got it no more. You know that? Oh, huh? Yes. Yeah. Now look, you didn't even see that coming, did you? What do you think the champ would do to you? It's harsh, but... Maybe I can help out around here, you know? You're like royalty here, kid. You want those guys to see you carrying towels and buckets around? I gotta be around it. All right, kid. Thanks, I'm like... He's really hurt. I get it though. It's like if he even just does one fight, he could get permanent damage. If I want a lot more pressure put on for a rematch. There's still a lot of people out there that think he won. Let's go after some new meat. What are you afraid of, Tony? Ernest? Ooh. I saw you beat that man. Man kept coming after you. And we don't need that kind of man in our life. Wow. Let it go. I want a whole new campaign started. I want something done publicly to bring this man out. Oh, <laughs> completely ignored him. The fact that uh, they know that Rocky's actually a real threat to his entire career, because they know he could beat him. <laughs> what was this? It's kind of funny, don't you think? Yeah, just laugh at it. Show this black and angry how to snarl and punch. That's it, you see. That's ugly. That's a snarl. Yeah, Johnny, I'll, I'll let him do it. I got it, bro. He's such a kind guy. He doesn't care that he's doing gross work, but it looks bad. Hey, wait a minute. Oh, don't. Whoop. Did you think of anything tougher to say than oops? <laughs> what 
the hell, man? This is what he gets for being the nicest guy. Lots of people love you, but lots of other people just steamroll you. Listen, you want to come home with me? Maybe I'll tell you a few jokes on the way home and maybe you'll laugh. We need a few laughs in our life. What do you think? A lot of cows wear belts, but the horns don't work. Is that killing you? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> you really sweet, good man. Is he talking to you? Nah, he probably has me mixed up with somebody else. So disrespectful. People out there want to see me in a rematch with a timid fellow who calls himself the Italian Stallion. But this man does not have the honor to meet me in the ring. He's scared. You know it and I know it. This lucky club fighter, and that's what he was, does not have the skill to last five minutes in the ring with a superior athlete. I get that it's a business strategy, but it's... It's just making the wound worse. Call me, Balboa! I'm Brad Musburger. I'm a real It's supposed to be a fight. You gave that up. It's ripping him apart. He needs, a, like, a purpose. What the kid have good things? You don't have to prove anything. I don't want you to do it. I never asked you to stop being a woman, you know? I'm asking you, please, don't ask me to stop being a man. Please. Wow. What a flippin' line. Who is it? <laughs> I think we ought to knock his block off. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Let's do it. It's tough, but he's got to do what he's got to do, right? I hope that she can help support him, though, even though she doesn't like it. I want the whole world to see me destroy this man after two short rounds. This time, this time you all will see the real Apollo Creed, lightning fast and hard to catch. No playing, no jiving, just business. Oh. Yeah, like, as much as Rocky's got ability, I think he is going to have to train a lot harder this time. What are you going to do with the money? Well, the first thing I gotta do is I gotta pay the rent, you know? <laughs> He's so likable. I made this list on the way over. I was just thinking of things to do. I'd like to get a couple of hats, a motorcycle, and a couple of quarts of perfume for Adrian. She likes to smell good. As some <laughs> Muppet toys, you know, Ernie and Big Bird and that. I love this. It's making him out to be such a good guy compared to Apollo Creed. <laughs> Rocky, got anything derogatory to say about the champ? Derogatory. Yeah, he's great. <laughs> Come November, you're mine. She's so mad, I love it. She's very upset. Oh, well. Like, unintentionally makes his opponent even more frustrated because of how just chill he is. I mean, left-handed fighters, they're the worst. Right's no damn good. They ought to outlaw southpaws. Why didn't you tell me this before? I didn't want to hurt your feelings. <laughs> you didn't want to hurt his feelings, really. <laughs> you gotta change everything. I don't learn to be a right-handed fighter and start fighting right-handed. And then it changed suddenly. Yes. Speed's what we need. We need greasy, fast speed. This guy's a great trainer. You have to wear that stinking sweatshirt. Well, it brings me luck, you know. Why has he got a chicken? Chase this little chicken. Oh my gosh. Why do I gotta chase a chicken for? It's embarrassing. <laughs> you catch this thing, you can catch grease lightning. Come on, get him! Get him, get him, get him! Come on, what's the matter with you? Get Oh, that's great. Come on! Move your tail! Move your tail! Oh, look at him. He's getting so tired. It's working. I feel like a Kentucky Fried Idiot. <laughs> 500 times! Hey, Mick, I want to use my other arm. If you do, I'm going to chop it off. Sorry, are you finished? Yeah. Can we go to work? I love the accent. Can we go to work? <laughs> Oh my gosh. Rocky, mate. You gotta eat lightning. You gotta crap thunder. I have to put you in a cage. Kid. Where are you going? We're not finished. Is it because of Adrian? I think he needs Adrian to be in his corner, you know. Oh, careful. You have a baby. Jeez, he's got them squirrels! Ditching the guy when he needs your help? I can't believe my ears. You're messing up his brain real bad. He's gonna get hurt because of you. No, oh, don't say that. Don't say that! What do you do? What's oh, he no. doing? What's wrong? Oh, no. Training like a damn bum, you know that? Bum. A bum! Hey, maybe I ain't got it no more. Then don't you waste my time no more. I'm too old to waste my time trying to train a no-good loser like you. Mate. Your wife's sick. She's sick? Oh, she better not lose this baby, please. The baby is fine, even though oh, it's a month no. premature. What is it? It's a boy. Oh, oh nice. She's had complications. <gasps> 
Your wife was hemorrhaging when she was brought in, caused by straining of overwork. Sudden loss of blood has caused her to slip into a coma. Oh, he's gonna feel even worse because of the work that did that. Don't worry about nothing. You just sleep as long as you want, okay? Because I'm gonna be here when you wake up. <laughs> so sad. He only just got married. She does look pale. I'm sorry for body. I love that he's trainers so invested in his life you're gonna be swapping punches with the most dangerous fighter in the world stand up and fight this guy hard but don't lay down in front of him like this he wants to bury you he wants to humiliate you and he said you are one time lucky bum may this guy be a good preacher <laughs> do you want to stay here i'll stay with you i'll stay with you i really yeah. hope this whole ordeal is enough for rocky to have the heart to go the distance again. I just wrote this thing for you, Adrian, I don't know. Remember when we was on ice skates? I thought you were supposed to be great, but I kept giving you lip, and you kept trying to slip so I could catch you. And that was our first day, and after that, every day was great. Aww. And wherever you go, because as long as I got this ring, I'll always be there to catch you. <laughs> so sweet. Yes! Awake! Oh, thank God. I knew you'd come back. Oh. Mommy! Baby! Is that it? Oh my gosh, <laughs> dude. It was premature, bro. What about after the father? Rocky Jr. <laughs> Come on, you really want to do that? You look so tired. If you don't want me mixing with Creed no more, we'll make out some other kind of way, you know? There's one thing I want you to do for me. What? Come here. What? Win. Oh, yes. What are we waiting for? Take this! <laughs> that was perfect. Oh, let's go. He's gonna get so fired up now. Come on, Rocky. That's what he needed. Come on, mate. Just like that, he's a pro again. Gee, he looks a little bigger in this than he did in the last movie. Mate, this is intense training. Damn, mate. <laughs> oh my gosh, <laughs> his poor stomach. This fight, I'm gonna be so upset. <laughs> ah, here we go again. Oh, I really hope everyone gets on his side again. Oh my gosh, the sign to follow him. <laughs> All these kids. This is great. Oh, let's go. That's impressive. Oh my gosh. <laughs> There's so many people. That's a lot of kids. <laughs> Like he already won. <laughs> I gotta go. Adrian, I wish the doctor let you go to this fight. Oh, Adrian can't go. Girls love you, men, women, old people love you, young people love you. The best. You're the man. He's yours. This bum shouldn't even be in the same ring with you. Can I stick him? Oh, that's awesome. He has all of Philadelphia on his side. Don't be late for your own fight. You yeah, better go fight now. I love you. I love you too. 
<laughs> you know he's scared. Mother, come on! Mother, come on! Come on! Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm going to the fight right now. Oh, I got the family and the baby and all that stuff. If you can throw down a blessing so that if I get beat up, it won't be too bad, you know? Could you <laughs> oh, I love that. Thanks a lot, Father. Listen, I appreciate it. I gotta go. I'm so late. I'll see you in church. Oh. <laughs> I'm late. That's fantastic. Yep, don't want to be late to Apollo's funeral. <laughs> Good luck, son. Don't miss. Hey, run, I'll break your head. <laughs> son, we gotta fight. Sorry, I'm sorry. I'm here. Remember that? Get He's so chill as well. He's like, hey, yo. <laughs> Get it. Praying at the sink again. Get it. He's off. He's off. He's off. It's time, kid. I love the difference between their their routine, getting ready for the fight. Ooh, I like the gold. He just robe nice, better than last year. That's for sure. The baggy one last year. This is gorgeous. It's perfect. Dude, I like it. This is gorgeous. It's perfect. <laughs> Why this fighter of limited ability has gained such popularity is such a mystery. Oh my gosh, that was rude. <laughs> this area is certainly packed with Rocky's people. <laughs> These people are for you, Rock! And the champion, Apollo Creed. Oh, okay. Not as much of a show this time. He's taking it more serious. Who'd you expect? I was hoping it wouldn't show. <laughs> <laughs> as much as I think that Apollo's in better physical condition, I also feel like he doesn't have as much confidence maybe in himself. You're going down, man. You're going down. Don't let it bother you, kid. Won't it bother you? Yeah. <laughs> 15 rounds for the heavyweight championship of the world. Uh, I'm nervous. I feel like I'm in the ring. I'm like, uh. The Italian stallion, Rocky Anywhere in the civilized world. Gosh. Heavyweight champion world. Apollo Creed. Mate, he really gets hyped up from the <laughs> announcer. <laughs> Mate, Apollo looks big. He's going down. Oh. I don't know if Rocky's head's in the game at the moment. Don't go back to fighting Southpaw till I tell you. Now you get him, see? He's going to try to kill you quick. And you get through this first round, and he's ours. Oh, boy. I have a feeling he's going to get beaten up at least for a little bit. <laughs> As Rocky Balboa prays in his corner, the champion dancing over in his corner. His strength is endurance, right? Lasting. The century, super fight two, and there's the bell. Oh. Oh, my gosh. Gee. He's fighting right-handed. I don't believe it. Southpaw still he is fighting right-handed. Well, he's not really fighting yet. <laughs> oh, gosh, dude. <laughs> Mate, Apollo's doing way better this time. Oh, my gosh, dude. Is that all you got? A good right hand from a three good right hand. Staggered round. This is a brutal first round. <laughs> That looked exactly how they thought it was going to look. What the hell, mate? You can lose a point for that, right? Good round. Good round. I broke my nose again. He's got to be in great shape to withstand that butchery. And I'll tell you, that's just what it is. I mean, he's got a point, right? He did a good job lasting. Apollo, you can't be hurt because you are too tough. And this man is dangerous. This man is dangerous. Man is dangerous. dangerous. I'm dangerous. I'm dangerous. That guy's great. Not no, all this. He's only a man. <laughs> Run over him! Okay. Come on. I'd love to have him hyping me up. But here comes Balboa! Come on. Yes! Oh, this guy's a showboat. Here it comes! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I can't watch. This is brutal. Don't get up! Just stay down. I told you. The body, the body, the body. I hope he gets tired. Here comes the champion. He's coming back. 
he's coming, come on. I ain't going down no more. He's become the animal again. Get him, get him, get him. Come on. Get him. Just, yeah, just hit him. Come on, mate. Come on. Stop. <laughs> Yes, yes, come on, come on. Mate, he takes a beating, doesn't he? Oh. I gotta watch on Apollo Creed's mind right now. He's yeah, this is when it starts to shift, right? <laughs> Rocky's got that stamina. Yes. Hey, this is not what they were expecting. We're getting the same show we got in the last movie. That keeps hitting him in the eyes as well. Oh, no. He's going to go down again. Stop, stop. <laughs> Knockout. You understand? I said I know. It works. It works. Come on, switch to Southpaw. Listen, you're getting killed out there. It's my life. Know. All he has to do is stay away, and he retains the title. Now switch now to Southpaw anyway, will you? No yes. tricks, say switching. Yeah, I made no tricks. All right, all right. Go ahead and switch it. Dude, no, you need to. You you need a miracle now. Abraham, don't go for the knockout. You got it one. You're going down. Oh. No way. Oh my gosh, dude, he's still cocky. <laughs> Even after all that. Oh, he's going for the knockout. The champion is beating back no! in the corner. No! Oh, mate. Do it. Yes, yes, yes. Come on. A leaping hook from the exhausted champ. Oh, yes. yes. It's blind instinct. But now it's all conviction. We've got a oh race to the champion. Now it is Creed coming back. No way. She looks destroyed. And I just want to say thanks to Paul. Thank Mickey for training me. We love you, Rock! And I love you too. <laughs> oh, thank God. Except for my kid being born. Aww. It's the greatest night in the history of my life. I just want to say one thing to my wife who's home. Yo, Adrian. Yo, Adrian! I did it! <laughs> yes! this guy <laughs> i'm honestly so overjoyed with the result of that fight <laughs> what a payoff to such a slow burn sort of um first half of the movie right where it was just so much about um rocky's relationship with adrian and the coming of like and you know their um their child on the way and just the different sort of conflicts that he had with feeling dissatisfied with his life um, after the fight and not really having a sense of direction or purpose anymore. Um, I thought that that was super interesting. I felt like there was a lot more character development and attention to 
just his well-being in this movie which was super interesting but i'm glad that we got such a good payoff where he actually won the fight it felt really justified i think i mentioned when i watched rocky that um it would have felt a little bit um cheap if rocky had won that fight straight away and it was good that he lost that first fight but went the distance where i feel like in the second movie um it was it was perfect for him to win the fight by just a margin right um <laughs> by, by that much right um yeah it just felt it just felt right after everything he went through um yeah but i just really love how much attention there was in this movie to just i guess rocky as um you know what he needs in his life right i mean he had adrian they got married which was <laughs> fantastic um but it kind of showed that even though he had everything he wanted the fact that he was working a job that he wasn't happy with and he felt like he wasn't really fulfilled um you know it goes to show just how much it affected his his life um it's unfortunate right because i think adrian was right you know it's just fighting for the rest of your life and getting destroyed like that isn't really a good thing um but you know i think it was in rocky's nature you know that that's who he is um he's a fighter and um you know it's unfortunate but i think it was necessary that he took the fight um I'm just hoping that he's able to be a really, really good father. I know he's a good, he will be a good father, but I just hope that he won't, um, you know, he won't get too sidetracked or like too distracted by all these other things going on in his life. I hope that um, he's able to protect and provide for his family um, without being destroyed, you know, like, I just hope he doesn't get hurt too much, um, but I guess we'll see. Um, yeah brilliant um i really loved just the the way that it set up apollo to be like this villain um despite the fact that he just wanted to have like a rematch that was it um apollo to me seems like an actual kind of he seems like an okay guy um who's just very like all about the business right um nothing's really that personal to him um <laughs> except for the fact that um people thought that he was um he got beat by rocky right um <laughs> i thought i thought it was pretty funny at the start he was reading all those negative comments and taking them all so personally <laughs> um but it's a real it's a real thing right i i felt like apollo was what is like the closest thing to what um you know a, a world-class fighter is actually like like just super competitive so much bravado you know before the fight he was getting hyped up he was like i'm the best i'm the best it's like that's what you actually have to be like to be a fighter you know um rocky's a bit of um you know an, an outlier in that sense that he's such a humble dude and he's so like before the fight he's just praying you know um it's very strange but it makes you root for him right he's the underdog uh so I, I just love the the reinforcing of the whole theme of just like the fact that he's got so much heart and stamina that he's able to withstand the test of time in those rounds that towards the end of the fight he's able to come back and actually turn the tide um i just i, I think that's that's brilliant it's really really good i i had a great time i can't wait to watch the third movie i'm super interested to see where this is going since there's so many movies there's even the creed movies so i'm just super curious um yeah i hope you guys enjoyed yourself i did please like and subscribe and i will see you all next time stay cozy